Next, we're going to set the table up for typical GYN cases, which include hysterectomy, uh, DNC, um, tubal ligation, etc. Uh, before the patient gets onto the table, we can have the opposite arm board and the opposite stirrup on the table ready to go. There's two ways to do the case. One is with the Promrex, you can lower the leg plate down to 105 degrees. That way, any vaginal retractors or, or uh, gravity retractors will hang uh, uh, nice, nicely with the, tape, with the leg plate tucked. Or you can do it with a lightweight transfer board removing the leg plates. So depending on how the doctor likes to set up the case. Um, table locked in position. We've removed one of the sections from the table to shorten the table up. And we may wind up, depending on the size of the patient, removing another section, which is, again, the benefit of a sectional top. We are going to slide the table to the foot end till it stops the first time. That is the GYM position. And then we're going to uh, get the patient prepared, transfer the patient onto the table, and add the uh, stirrup and the other arm board. We've uh, put the patient on the table. We have placed the other arm board on the table. We have placed the patient's head in a donut. We will remove the head section. And we can go ahead and put the stirrup on the table with a, uh, a blade clamp. Adjust the stirrup to accept the patient. Lower them down a little into lithotomy. And then we're going to remove the headrest so the anesthesiologist has uh, more room for airway management. Legs are on the table now. Patient is under anesthesia. Head section has been removed. Now we're going to put her into lithotomy. We've added the other stirrup. And we're going to place her into lithotomy, making sure her foot is against the bottom of the, the stirrup. And the placement of the stirrup is against the hip, so that as the stirrup comes up and moves, it's moving in conjunction with the hip. Her other leg into the stirrup. And padding over. Velcro down nice and tight. And now we can place her into whatever the doctor prefers, high lithotomy, low lithotomy. We take the end section off the table. We remove the pad from the second section. Turn the hand control on and we lower the leg plate to 105 degrees, which tucks underneath the table. Now we may want to employ some Trendelenburg depending on how the surgeon likes to set up. So the leg plate is tucked and we will probably employ a little Trendelenburg to the patient. Uh, this is a typical lithotomy setup, high lithotomy setup for GYN. You can see that we have shortened the table up to fit her body where anesthesia has good exposure to the head and the doctor is in a very comfortable position with the cutout and with the base of the table for sitting, standing and positioning the patient properly for the procedure. To recover the patient, very simple. Hand control, level button. Level button is going to raise up the leg plate in increments, recover her back to the center of the column. Then we add the pad and the additional leg section. We've added the pad to the level leg plate and we've attached the end section to the table. Again, just lock it into place and Remove her legs from the stirrups. Back onto the table. And let go. 
Okay, we have recovered her from lithotomy back onto the leg sections. And we are going to then remove the arm board on the, on the transfer side and transfer her over to the bed following uh, extubation.